Hello, good evening. How are you? Hi. Okay, I'm sorry. How's it going? How's it going? Okay, good guys. So, did you did you see the sky? Did you see the sky? No, the thunders. Nobody yeah. saw the sky yet. Yeah. There's a lot the of lightnings. Um, the lightnings. The lightnings. Lightnings. Yeah. Lightning. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay. Lightnings. The lightning. Lightnings. Yeah. There's a lot of there's a lot of uh, thunders right now on the sky. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's about to rain. Is it raining? Where you at? Where you at? I'm in yeah. I'm in Miral Valle. Ah, okay. Yeah. It's, it's, it's very, raining there. Very close to the volcano. No, it's not raining yet. It's not raining yet. Not yet. What about you, okay. Kenya? Kenya? Car Carla, is it raining? Is it raining right now? No. No rain? Carla or Kenya, teacher? Both. <laughs> <laughs> no, there is no raining right now. There is no rain. There is no rain right now. Okay. What about you, Kenya? I'm ask teacher. I okay. I am answered. Oh, you answered. So no yeah. no no rain. No rain. Carlos, Ulises, no rain. No yet. Uh, it's very hot. Was raining. Okay, good guys. So let's start the class today. We will continue with the simple past. So first, we will do a quick uh, session. Let's say uh, I'm just going to ask you: Do you have any questions? Did you practice? Did you practice the simple past? Anybody? Okay. Okay. So I'll understand that you, you, you have practiced, you practiced last night or today during the day. Okay, so if you did, any questions with the structure? Any questions with the structure of the simple past? No? Oh. No? Okay, so if there are no questions, let's go with something really quick. Um, I'm going to share my screen with you i send you this image i send you this image just to review review the image really quick okay um i want you to pay attention to this part okay so we can all be on the same page um okay first of all we talked about the pronunciation of the ed endings Okay, the pronunciation of the ED endings. It's very simple. The first rule of the ED endings pronunciation is the sound T. The sound T. So, pongo la punta de mi lengua atrás de los dientes frontales, los dientes um, superiores. Empujo despacio y soplo. Eh, se escucha ese sonido, ¿no? T. Entonces, tenés que hacer ese ejercicio todos los días. That's the sound. So, t, the t, t sound. Okay? So, for verbs, for voiceless verbs, okay, voiceless sounds at the end of the verb. So, listen. If we say cook, 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 okay, walk, walk, talk, talk, okay, if we say dance, Dance, miss, practice, type, type, hope, help. Esos fueron los verbos en su forma base. So, if the verb ends voiceless, like laugh, stuff, scuff, okay, we add the ED. And then we add the sound, t, 
So we say cooked, walked, talked. By the way, this is talk, talked, talk, talked. Okay, dance, danced, miss, missed, practice, practiced. Okay, and so on. Okay, that's the first rule. The second rule is the sound. Como si el, cel el celular estuviera en vibrador, pones tu lengua entre los dientes y que vibre la lengua, ¿ok? Solo la puntita. ¿Ok? So, if there is vibration, if there is vibration in your mouth, here, for example, if you say leave, leave, wave, arrive, okay, harm, confirm, perform, fun, sign, clean, call, kill, stroll, okay? So, if, if there is vibration, then you add the sound, okay? You say, lived, waved, arrived, phoned, signed, and so on. That's the second rule. And the last rule is the in or then sound. In or then, okay? Eh, esos son menos los verbos. So, you, if you say boat, si el verbo ya termina en el sonido t o v en su forma base, entonces agregas la ed, and it sounds voted. Voted. Habrá personas que digan voted. Voted. Hmm. Ok. Waited. 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 En británico. Ok. Americano. Waited. Wanted. Wanted. O wanted. Si vean a los expedientes del FBI. The most wanted. The most wanted. Ok. Pero. I wanted to tell you. I wanted to tell you. Ok. Minded. Minded. Sounded. Sounded. Damaged. Damaged. Perdón. Demanded. Demanded. Okay, damaged by in the second rule. Okay, I sent you this this chart. I sent you this chart um, to the group so you can study it. That's one of the ways you can learn the ED sounds. And the second way. And the second way is following the following chart. Where is it? Hold on. Here it is. Okay. Let me show it to you. Un día no tenía nada que hacer, so me puse a, a dividir esto, ¿no? So, estos son sonidos de consonantes. Las vocales caen en la segunda regla. Y la T y la D en la tercera regla. So, este cuadro ya se lo voy a enviar también al WhatsApp. Si tú querés, puedes poner solo este header, solo este, um, esta um, línea de arriba. Y puedes ponerte a escribir aquí abajo de cada uno ejemplos de verbos, ¿ok? Que llevan ese sonido final, ¿ok? Igual les voy a compartir un video de Rachel's English, que es una persona que prácticamente ella solo habla de fonética en el inglés, ¿ok? Para que vean la posición de su boca, cómo lo hace, ¿ok? Any questions? Solo quería as, as abordar este tema súper rápido porque no está en la plataforma. Y nos tenemos que basar en el contenido de la plataforma para irnos moviendo en los contenidos, ¿ok? Este día eso vamos a hacer, hay bastante que cubrir. ¿Alguien tiene alguna pregunta antes de proceder? Chicos, siento que estoy hablando solo. Hello. No teacher. No teacher. No teacher. No teacher. Ok. Hmm. Only okay. practice. Only practice. Just practice. Just practice. Ok, Just perfect. Practice. Yes, yeah, practice. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes. You yes. Don't... It is raining. It's raining a lot right now. Mm. And actually, yeah. hold on. What there? <laughs> yeah, I have a leak. I leak? think yeah, I have a leak. Yeah, I think I have a leak. A leak. 
Hold on, give me just one second, okay? I'm just going to close the window. Okay. Okay, I'm back. Thank you. So let's continue, guys. Let's go to the platform so we can move on. Is it? Okay, I send you this as well. Today we will cover the uh, the past of B, the past of B yesterday, we did this. Let's go with the objective. Gloria, can you help me please reading the objective for today? Where is it? Okay. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation using past simple pay uh, yeah pay. pay attention for details and pronunciation okay very good gloria great job so let's say a conversation repeat a conversation okay attention attention details 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 and last pronunciation pronunciation yeah very good pronunciation okay let's move on so now we do have some listening here so i want you to go like this okay with your headsets with this we're gonna do some listening right now okay and then we will answer these questions. It's like four questions, just four questions, okay? So I'll play it. Si no escuchan, me dicen, aunque estoy seguro que sí se va a escuchar, okay? Good. Three, two, one. Let's go. Oh, hold on. Okay, let's do it. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So, what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay, but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then, we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots yeah. to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Listening. Okay. En escucharon bien? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Yes. Okay. So, algunos de ustedes ya hicieron este ejercicio. Vamos a movernos, okay, a través del ejercicio. So let's go. Carla, Marcela, who had a boring time? Who had a Boring time. John. John? Okay. Do we all agree? Yes. Yes? Gloria, excellent. Very good. Thank you, Gloria. Okay, Gloria, thank you. Who had a good time? Who had a good time? Lara. Lara. <laughs> en inglés se dice como el animalito, el periquito. Laura. 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 Yeah, that's it, Laura. Okay, okay. Now let's go with the next one. Who met an old friend? Who met an old friend, Karen? Laura. Laura? Laura. 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 
I know, I know, believe me. He escuchado tantas veces ese nombre de americanos y siempre dicen Laura, Laura, Laura. Laura. Okay. So, who got home late? Who got home late? Uh, Jose Cabrero. John. John. Okay, let's see. Tan, 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 tan. Oh. oh, no, it wasn't John. Who got home late? Both. 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 Okay, remember, it's a TH, so you say both. 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 Okay, both. 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 Okay, let's see. There you go, yes. That's true. It's both. Then you have Laura and Laura and John. Excellent, guys. Easy. Okay, let's go with the next part so we can proceed and make sure we practice the conversation for today. I need a volunteer. Janita. Okay. <laughs> Participants will have a chance to listen to a conversation where past or be is used. Is used. So, uh huh. So you see, use the, the word use. So you say used. Used. Espero que empiecen a practicar eso. Busquen verbos regulares en el estado que les envié. Y uh, pregúntense, ¿no? O vean el, la última columna. Ahí están los tres uh, símbolos. La T, la ID y, um, y la D. So, para que vayan escuchando y aprendiendo eso, el sonido. Use. No hay vibración. Ah, pues suena a T al final. Use. Ok. Great job. Let's move on. So, now we have a video. Got it. Got it. Can you hear me? Yes, Maria. Hello, Maria. It's just a tap because today I doesn't use a, a headset. I, okay, so you say, I am not using a headset. Okay. I am not using a headset. I'm not using a headset. Using. Presente continuo. No estoy usando headsets. Got it. Okay. Great job. Excellent. Okay, guys, let's go with this. Uh, this is the video. Please pay attention. Eh, le voy a poner en silencio de nuevo. Se oye un par de ruidos por ahí al fondo. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. John, how was your... So, okay, I send you this image to the WhatsApp, but I would like somebody to help me so we can practice really quick. I need two volunteers, a man and a woman. Me? Okay, Maria? No, who? Yeah, who? Yeah, Maria. Maria and who else? Carlos? No? Janira, Janira, okay. Okay. Another girl said me. Okay, so that will be Janita, I think. Okay. <laughs> okay, Janita and Carlos. So, Carlos, you are Celia. Janita, you are done. Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, Janita, you're Celia. Carlos, you are done. Okay, one, two, three, action. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Bless you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. 
but we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, sometimes incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay, great job. Very good. Carlos and everybody. Necesito que desde este momento ustedes sean críticos de sus compañeros, de la manera en la que ustedes leen también o pronuncian algo. ¿Cómo lo hacemos? Eh, debido a que ellos, al parecer aún tengo ese problema, si yo pongo otra ventana acá, ustedes ven todo gris, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok, es un problema de la virtualización de mi computadora, aún estoy trabajando en arreglarlo. So, eh, entonces... Para evitar eso, agarro una libreta y ahí voy tomando nota de algunas palabritas. Es importante que ustedes estén criticando entre ustedes y a ustedes mismos más que todo. Hay un proceso de, en su cerebro que se llama autocorrección. A mí lo que me ayudó a aprender inglés fue eso, autocorregirme. ¿Cómo lo logré? Pues simplemente al adquirir vocabulario desde los siete años, sin darme cuenta, o sea, yo andaba acá y miraba el palo y decía, ¿cómo se, cómo se dice poste? ¿Cómo se dice poste? Ah, ok, me, me quedaba con eso, ¿no? La espinita, lo buscaba al llegar a la casa, o se andaba el diccionario ahí conmigo, no tenía celular. Ah, lo buscaba, y decía, ah, Paul, pole, pole. Después le preguntaba a alguien, buscaba la pronunciación en alguna parte, y decía, Paul, Paul, Paul. Lo repetía hasta que se me quedaba. Unas tres palabras diarias, unos tres verbos diarios. ¿Ok? Entonces, cuando ya tienes el vocabulario en la cabeza, tu cerebro de un solo te dice, ahí no, espérate. Se dice, cousin. Y se cousin. Cousin. Y ahora en adelante, después de un reading, le voy a preguntar, ¿alguien que me ayude? Okay. ¿Qué tal lo hizo su compañero? ¿Alguien que me ayude? Que haya identificado una palabra y uno por uno vamos. So, en este caso yo identifiqué cousin. No es cousin. Okay. Cousin. Cousin. Quito la U. Okay. Cousin. Eh, la palabra about a. About, ah, ¿por dónde estaba? ¿Quién me ayudó a buscarlo? ¿Dónde está? <risa> down, down, down. Oh, no. the best thing about the trip. No, 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 no. About, about, about. Um, about a week. ¿Oí? Sí, no hago una pausa. Uno. Ok, no digo about a week. No. About a week. About a week. Repeat. About a week. 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 Y la palabra something. Something. No. Some. Okay. Look. Look. You say some. Thing. Y luego pones la lengua entre los dientes, la punta de la lengua, y soplas un poquito. Decís. Thing, como que si la TH fuese una Z, es something, something, something. There you go. Very good. Okay. Any new word, any new word on this conversation, any new word, new vocabulary? No? Okay. Carlos said waves. No, someone else. Uh, wa waves. Waves or waves? Waves. Okay. Waves. So, yeah, it's the waves. Excellent. Very good. You go surfing, right? So, the waves. Excellent, Jose. Las olas. Very good. Waves. Okay. También puedo decirte, hey, she's, I'm waving. I'm waving at you. I'm waving. Con ING quito la E, agrego ING, a wave, y ya tengo waving. ¿Qué quiere decir? Saludar así, con la mano, hacer una ola con la mano. Hey! That's waving. Ok. Any other? ¿Algo otra? Amazing. Pronunciation. The pronunciation of amazing. Tarea. Amazing. Adam Smith. Adam Smith. It's amazing. Yeah. There's a song of Adam Smith called Amazing. <laughs> you know Dream Man. Huh? You know Dream Man. 
Dream on. Yeah, of course. Okay. Any other? Any other? Uh, oh, okay. Listen, happen. Ese verbo es regular. ¿Quién me dice cuál es la pronunciación? Happen. 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 Okay. Una pregunta. ¿Hay vibración? ¿O no hay vibración? No. 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 Si es, si hay vibración. A ver, todos tapen la nariz y digan happen. 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 Y la N, ¿dónde está? Happen. Te queda acá, en la fosa nasal. Entonces, si hay vibración en, en la fosa nasal, es la segunda regla. Happened. 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 Ahí, perfecto, Felipe. Very good. Happened. That's the way you do it. Happened. Any other? Hey, what about was? Cloudy. How was? Teacher, cloudy, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Cloudy. 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 Con R, con R, R en lugar de la D. Cloudy, cloudy, cloudy. Cloudy. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. We went surfing, away, so what's okay? So let's look at the context, right? Hi, Don. How was your vacation? Listen, how was your vacation? Vacation, vacation, vacation. <laughs> okay, how was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Más americano, we had a, we had a, we had a great time. Okay, we had a great time. Lucky you, lucky you. No es Lucky, okay, Lucky es el perrito, le decía. Lucky you. Lucky you. Repetimos, lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Hey, perfecto, chicos. Lucky you. How long were you there? How long were you there? How long were you there? You, you, you. Perfect. You there. Sí, you. About a week. About a week. Perfect. About a week. Fantastic. About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Was the weather okay? Was the weather okay? Okay, not really. It was cloudy most of the time. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing. Oh, surfing. The surfing, surfing. Every day. The waves were amazing. The waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? So, what was the best thing about the trip? Trip, trip. Well, something incredible happened. Happened. You won't believe it. You won't believe it. Okay? So, any questions? No questions? No, lucky you, teacher. Lucky you. In the chair. <laughs> Walking. What was it? Lucky you. What, what is the meaning? Oh, lucky, lucky you. Yes, yes, please. Suertudo. O suertuda. Lucky you. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Lucky you. Lucky you. Chicos, una cosa más, las expresiones en inglés son muy naturales y es bueno utilizarlas. Eso como, wow, really? No. What? ¿Algo otra? Es como cuando en español decís, no, hombre, chele, right? So, right? Down. Right. So, what, José? Down. Down. You're going down. Ajá. <laughs> uh -huh. What? Any other? Okay. Great. Really, really? Really, really, Ulysses? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Of course. Okay. Got it? Fantastic. Fantastic. Excellent, guys. Waves. Teacher, waves. ¿Qué, eh, ¿Qué es? What is the meaning of waves? What is the meaning of waves? Olas. Waves. 
Thank you. But, uh, Emperatriz, I can say, uh, Emperatriz waves at me every time I see her. Emperatriz waves at me every time I see her. Emperatriz me saluda cada vez que la veo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, so we are 15. I'm going to split you in groups so you can practice among each other, okay? Good? Let's go. Just five minutes and we come back, okay? Okay, one, two, three, let's go. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Jose, Danny, let's go. There you go, Danny. Okay, Dani, ¿puedes ver la invitación? Excellent, very good. María. Yeah. Me? Yes, you can start. Okay. okay. Hi, Don. Who was your vacation? It was the plan. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Look at you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day, the waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. Okay. Y ahora? Let's practice, Maria. Uh, okay. You are uh, Celia and I am Don. Could you repeat again? Because in my downtown is raining right now and I can't really hear you well. And Danny, practice. Okay, and now? Danny, you, uh, are, you are done, um, Celia. Uh, I don't know. I, Celia, because I was done. Okay, excellent, Danny. Okay, hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. okay, great job, guys. Do it one more time, okay? I'm going with another group. Okay, okay thank you. Great job. Was the water okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time. Well, we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? 
Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. So now I I think uh, vice versa, right? Okay. Okay, I start. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We we had a great time. Look at you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was starting most of the time, but we went perfect every day. The waves were amazing. So, what was the worst thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. Um, now do it again. Keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. Keep going. Okay. Yeah. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii my, with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time, but, but we went through The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. Very good. Great. Yeah. yeah, let's do it again. Keep going, keep going. Gloria. Okay. Soy Don Empieza. Let me check, okay? Yeah. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii. We, I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We, got, we had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time, but we went surfing every day. We wait, the, ba the waves were amazing. So, what, what was the best, the best thing about uh, the trip? Well, something incredibly happened. You won't believe it. Okay. I am Celia. Yeah. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? Gloria? It, it was ex change the role. Okay. Uh -huh. Hi. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. Was the weather okay? Not really. It was cloudy most of the time, but we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. Okay. Now, Yadira Emperatriz. Excellent. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, who person do you want to be? Mm. Who, repeat, who do you want to be? Okay, I'm sorry. Who, who do you want to be? <laughs> repeat, repeat. Who do you want to be? Who do you want to be? Perfect. Okay, do it again. Okay. Okay, it's okay. Hi. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. If sorry. you want, you can. You can. I don't. You can be done. Uh huh. Okay. 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 Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. 
How long were you there? How long were you there? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh, <laughs> Uh, about a week. Fantastic. What's the weather? Okay. No, really. It was slow in most of the time. But the waves we were amazing. So, what was the best things about the trip? Well, something incredible happened you won't believe it. Okay. Sí, pero por eso es bueno practicar, porque sí. se, se mejora un poquito. Yes, it's great to practice. Okay, guys, we're going to finish this session, okay? Let's go back. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, so here we are. We're back together. Let's wait for the other two. One, two. There we are. We're missing two. Okay, and there you go. Okay, guys, so really quick, let's go with the correction really quick. So we have, these are the areas of improvement that I wrote down, the areas of improvement. Estos no son errores, estos son áreas de mejora, ¿eh? Áreas de mejora. Correcto. Si sabes del FODA, sabes de qué te estoy hablando. Un error es incorregible, pero un área de oportunidad es siempre, siempre hay algo que mejorar, no, no importa que tú te creas que... O sea, FODA, no, siempre vas a tener algo que mejorar. Ok, so let's go with areas of improvement. Ok. Everybody, just listen. How? Y esto quiero recalcarlo muchísimo. No estás acostumbrado en el español a ocupar una W, ni al principio ni al final de las palabras. Salvo que te guste el whisky. ¿Ya? Ok, siempre van a ser alguna, um, algún anglosajismo en que ocupes. So, Say, cuando tengas una W, son dos U juntas. Entonces, U, ¿ok? Para hacer un ejercicio con eso, puedes ocupar esta pregunta, mira. Y es bien natural. En americano decir, where were we? ¿Oí? Where were we? Where were we? Yeah, where were we? ¿Dónde estábamos? ¿Sí? Por ejemplo, yo retorno aquí con ustedes. No sabía, me perdí en la clase. Where were we? ¿Dónde estábamos? ¿Ok? ¿Ok? O estás con la chica, ¿verdad? llega tu hermanito menor, te interrumpe y regresas a la conversación y... ¿Qué le estaba diciendo? Where were we? Where were we? Yeah, ok. <laughs> so, you say, how? 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 Teacher, el, yes. El, solo para diferenciar el, el, el where con el, de, el pasado de... Ah, ah, y el where de, de, de dónde Para este es el porque... yeah. la misma pronunciación Ulises, es la misma pronunciación where, where where, where we la misma, la misma misma pronunciación son sonidos homófonos sonidos homófonos, where, where ahí lo que cambia es la, lo que cambia es la, la escritura y el contexto eso te va a guiar la escritura y el contexto de la conversación, ¿ok? Good, let's continue. So, just listen and repeat if you want. You say, lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky on it. you. Now, let's put some feeling. Let's put some feeling on it. Lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. No, lucky you. 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 Okay. There you go. Okay. Most of the time. Aquí decimos así tal cual se lee. Most of the time. Most of the time. Most of the time. Most of the time. Very good. Next. Next. Incredible. 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 
Incredible. Incredible. Incredible. Tengo una D entre dos vocales. Tengo una D entre dos vocales. Ya, yeah. Incredi incredible. 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 It's incredible. incredible. Repeat, that's incredible. That's incredible. Incredible. That's yeah. incredible. Sí, como antes de la clase. Justo como antes de la clase, no sé si alguien vio el cielo antes de iniciar la clase, o yo vivo cerca del volcán, eh, habían tantos relámpagos, estuvo súper bonito. Wow. Súper bonito. That's incredible. That's incredible, excellent. That's incredible. Okay, next word. Vacation. 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 Pero más fresa, más fresa, ¿eh? No tan... Porque es v, es v, no es B. B, no. Vacation. 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 Ok, Ulises, vacation. Vacation. There you have. Excellent, very good. Next, you say happened. 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 Perfect. Excellent, Imperatrice. Happened. Happened. Okay. Happened. Excellent. Very good. Next. Cloudy. 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 And again, you have you have a D in the middle of two vowels, so you say cloudy. 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 Excellent. Again, you have a D in the middle of two vowels. So you have you say we had a we had a we had a great time. We had a great time. Great time. We had a great time. Like feeling. We had a okay. Great time. A lo a lo joy a lo joy the friends. We had a we had a great time. Okay. Okay. We had a great time. Easy. Okay. Next. Weather. 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 Look at this. <laughs> no, Danny, Danny, listen, listen. <laughs> Weather. Weather. There you go, Danny. Weather. Excellent. Weather. Weather. Insisto. Weather. A ver, ajá, Felipe. Weather. Weather. There you go. Hey, no voy a quitar el dedo de la llaga. Cada vez que tenés una TH, la lengua viene en medio de los dientes. A veces soplas, a veces no. Vas a soplar. Ok, mira, aquí tenés dos ejemplos bien claros. Decís weather o something. Hay Z y soplo. Something. 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 Something in something. the way she moves attracts me like no other lover. Yeah, something. Something in the way. Something. Something. Area, escuchen la canción Something de los Beatles. Okay? Something. Something. Yeah. Next. Lucky you. Something like that. Something like that. Lucky ah, ya lo teníamos acá. Okay. Pero recuerden, es you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Lucky you. Okay. Uh, no sé, Felipe, Dani, cuando te besaba una niña en quinto, en Kinder 5 o en prepa, ¿cómo decías? Sorry, teacher, I, I don't say class. Can you repeat me? No. Can you repeat it? Can you repeat it? Yeah. Cuando te besaba una niña en, en prepa o en Kinder 5, ¿cómo decías? You. You. Uh, uh. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> That's the way. About her. You, right? Ascoles. <laughs> Lo mismo. Los niños americanos tienen esto. You. Dice you. You, por decir asco. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Next. <laughs> Reacción tardía, pero okay. Anyways. Best thing. The best thing. Best thing. Repeat. Best. 
the best thing. 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 Si estás, no, aquí si no unís, esas dos tres no las puedes unir, no, the best thing. The best thing. The best thing. Thing. Best thing. Best thing. <laughs> okay, good. Next. Entonces, para poder pronunciar la W, les recomiendo repetir esta pregunta muchas veces. Where were we? 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 Karen, where were we? Where were we? There you go. There you go, guys. Excellent. Very good. Where were we? Okay. Let's continue. Let's see what is next. What is next on the platform, okay? So we can finish with that part. Tomorrow is our last day of the week with the classes. So let's see. Okay. Let's talk about the past of the verb to be. I will jump right into the video. In this session, participants will study, will study the past of be. Question and short answers will be taught, will be taught. Okay, so let's pay attention to the last video of this week. And this is about the verb to be. En presente decías, M is R. I am. Okay. You, we, they are. He, he, she, it is. But in past, there are only two, there are only two options. Okay. Listen. In this session, participants will study the past of be. Questions and short answers will be taught. Hello, nice to have you back. I'll make reference of the past of the verb be. Let's start. Past of be. Were you in Hawaii? Yes, I was. Was the weather okay? No, it wasn't. Were you and your cousin on vacation? Yes, we were. Were your parents there? No, they weren't. How long were you away? I was away for a week. How was your vacation? It was excellent. Contractions. Wasn't equals was not. Weren't equals were not. The past of be, am, and is, was, are, were. To ask questions using the past of be, we do it this way. Was, were, plus subject, plus complement, plus... Let's keep an eye. Let's keep an eye on that. That's a structure. You use was with singulars, were with plurals, and then you have the subject and the complement to make a question. Okay, let's continue. Last question mark. Were you my student? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Was she sad? Yes, she was. No, she wasn't. Were they late? Yes, they were. No, they weren't. Remember, we used be to express feelings, conditions, estates, and descriptions either in present or past. Now you try answering the following questions. Were you my student before? Were you happy yesterday? Were you late this morning? Okay, so if you paid attention, it's as simple as the verb to be, but in the past. Okay, do you have any questions? We only have four, uh, six minutes, six minutes. Anybody? In my case, it's clear. It's clear in your case, Maria, okay. 
Anybody? Questions, questions. Bien, como regla general les diré súper rápido para agilizar un poco esto. De momento estamos con el pasado simple. Y si tu teacher anterior te lo dijo cuando viste el verbo to be en presente, yo te lo repito ahora. Estamos en pasado simple, no vamos a ocupar otro verbo. Y al ocupar was o where, ese es mi auxiliar. Ahí lo tengo en positivo, en negativo y en pregunta. Lo ocupo para expresar feelings, por ejemplo. ¿Ok? Para expresar cómo me siento. No puedo meter otro verbo ahorita. Voy a ocupar el verbo to be. Y puedo decir, I was happy. ¿Ok? ¿Cuál sería el negativo, Carla? Mejía? Carla, Marcela. Uh, I wasn't. Ok, wasn't. perfecto. Contracción, ajá. Perfect. Ok. Someone else, what's the question? How do you make a question? Ok. Yeah. Was I happy? Was I happy? Was I happy? Es una pregunta cerrada, so puedo decir yes. I was. Oh. I wasn't. I wasn't. Esto, esto es bien sencillo. Ok. Were you a singer? Ok. Oh, voy a empezar con la positiva. Uh, you were a singer. Negative. You weren't a singer. And the question, were you a singer? Yes, I were. Oh, mental. Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Recuerden que al preguntar con you, contesto con I y vice versa. Ok. Questions. No questions, ok. Teacher, teacher. Teacher. Yep. José. How we know when need to, to make a switch? When you want to, to make a... A, a, a question, For example, you were a singer, and before you, you wrote, what did you? Ah, ok, ok. Es un error común iniciar una pregunta, y de hecho, hasta los americanos lo hacen. You were a singer. ¿Ya? O lo dice en la pregunta con una entonación de pregunta. You were a singer? You were a singer? ¿Sí? En lugar de decir, were you a singer? Okay. Es un error, pero gramaticalmente debería de ser esto. Were you a singer? El auxiliar, ojo con esto, y eso es lo que quería recalcar. Siempre el auxiliar, miren dónde va, dónde se posiciona. Ahorita no podemos agregar un verbo después de was o where. Solo vamos a agregar un calificativo o un adjetivo. Bien, mañana seguiremos cubriendo este tema y vamos a realizar el ejercicio que está en la plataforma. De igual manera, si necesitan ayuda, me escriben, ¿ok? Gotta go. Okay. Hey guys. Okay. Enjoy you, the teacher. rest of your evening. Good evening. See Good night. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Okay. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, Karen.